Hi and welcome, I'm Reverend Allie Bierman and you're joining us here today for Metaphysical Ministry International. Well, what's a metaphysical ministry all about? Well, it's all about spirituality, it's all about quantum physics, it's all about the 99% of reality that you cannot witness and cannot experience using only your five physical senses. We begin every week with a happy share. Well, why a happy share? If you look around the world today, there's so much that's not happy, there's so much that's unpleasant, there's so much that's downright horrible, even horrific. Well, that's because the great thought form that's going on in the world is all negative. Instead of buying into that form, create a habit of happiness for yourself. Every single day, look for things for which to be happy. Now here's the thing, I created a whole movement, the Happy Share Movement, and if you go over to thehappysharemovement.com or on Facebook, facebook.com forward slash the Happy Share Movement, and that's capital each letter, I'm sorry, capital, the, and then happy, and then share, and then movement. On either page, you put down what your happy share is for the day. That accomplishes a few things. Number one, when you're sharing that happy share, you get to relive that moment all over again. Why? Because your subconscious mind can't tell the difference between what's real and what's fantasy. So your body is letting those great feel-good chemicals flow. Plus, when you share something that feels good with other people, did you ever notice, you get to feel twice as happy. It's like it just gets magnified. And also, somebody else might see a happy share that you're sharing and think, oh yeah, that happened for me too. So you're brightening somebody else's world, shifting their energy, because you know what? When you're thinking happy, you can't be thinking crummy. And also, as the universe sees you looking for and noticing these happy shares, you don't been there all the time because you're not looking for them. You don't see them, so you don't get to be grateful for them. When you're looking for them and you see them and the universe sees that, you get even more things to be happy about every day. Now, every day when I put my happy share up there, I have to go through my list and say, which one do I want to share? So the one I'm going to share today is for two weeks I've been trying to register for a really cool class that will help enhance my ability to make videos of better quality for you. And the link wouldn't show up and the link wouldn't show up and the link wouldn't show up. And I kept asking my friend who sent me to the site and she said, you know what, it only shows up for some people. Well, yesterday I decided I'm going to grab the address, I'm going to send a check, get in the mail, because I sure want to be in that class. And then I thought, you know what, sometimes a link won't show up in one browser, but it does in another. So I went to a different browser. The page was all distorted, but the link was there, so I got to sign up for the class. I know I'm in, and I'm real excited about that. I'm real happy about that. And that is my happy share for today. This week, I get to be the minstrel minister, and I'm going to talk with you about faith. Faith. Do you ever stop to think about well, what is faith to you? Does it mean that you're devout or simply spiritual? Did I say simply spiritual? Is faith the same as trust? Is faith a must to get you through life with less strife each day? Taking bold and gentle steps to make your way to live your purpose your highest good could you? Take those big risks, take those bold and gentle steps without it. Frankly, I doubt it. Cause faith is what lets you jump off the mountaintop and fly high. Faith lets you do what you thought was impossible, what others said cannot be done. One day you find the confidence to move you past fear. Now, You've won. No more ho-hum in your living. Add more receiving to your giving. With faith, all is possible. With faith, they may... Oops. With faith, things work all the time. With faith, your life flows so fine. With faith, Things work all the time with faith. Your life looks so fine. I know it's a little bit more windy out here <laughs> than I realized. Anyway, the thing about faith is your life really works 
when you live in that space. When you put out a request or you sing or something is singing in your heart, when you have a desire, when you have a knowing, well, that's what faith is. It's a knowing that what you desire is going to happen. It's knowing that you're being heard by the universe, by the always one, by God. There's no doubt when you have faith. You see, doubt's your ego mind trying to stop you from changing, trying to stop you from asking for things that are new and different. Faith quiets that ego mind that wants to keep you stuck. Faith is what lets you move forward. My friend Dr. Stan Breakthrough Harris describes faith as the acronym Find Answers in the Heart. How are you going to live in your faith today? If you look up there, if you're on the website, you will see a page that says holding a space for. Well, holding a space for means what is it that you want in your world, that you want to become part of your reality that's not happening now? Maybe you want to live in a different place and you want to take a trip. Maybe you're looking to find a new partner. Whatever that thing is, it's not in your world now that you want to manifest. Go ahead, scroll down there and let us know what it is you want. And not only will it appear down there, it'll also appear up there on the Hold the Space for our page. And come back here at least once a week. Tell your friends and family to come here too. What you do is you read through the name and what the request is. And you just envision or send love or send and knowing that it's going to have in faith that it's going to happen because each person who's doing that is building a thought form for that person bigger and bigger and bigger you don't have to know who the person is just say their name and what it is they want it'll take you five minutes tops and probably less and you're going to help somebody change their life and so doing you're going to change yours because they guarantee what you give out you receive I'm so glad you joined me here today. If you haven't already, go on over there. Get your copy of How to Take Your First Steps on Your Spiritual Path. And please go on down there and click on Like. Also remember to go over to thehappysharemovement.com and share your happy share. It's a brand new site. And on Facebook, it's also brand new. So I appreciate you getting the word out. Because you know what happens when you're happy? You're free goes up here. Do you know where everything that you want that makes you happy exists? Up here. You need to be vibrating in harmony with the frequency up here. And if you're not happy, you're down here. And it's impossible. It's impossible for you to get anything that's up here if you're vibrating down here. The more people who are vibrating up here, the more it spreads through the community, through the whole world. The way to bring peace to the world is by loving and sharing and caring and being in service so that everybody gets to live their natural right of living in happiness that will also impact the planet. It's the only thing that's going to change the world. Be part of the movement. Change the world one smile at a time. Enjoy a wonderful week. Come every day and share your happy share. Watch your life change. Blessings.